Turning the tide on Title IX, Betsy DeVos today unveiled her proposal to change how schools investigate sexual misconduct. 24 Hour News 8 Susan Samples checked in with students at GVSU to get their thoughts. Susan. I was able to talk to two students today. Both worry that DeVos's proposal will make it less likely for victims to file complaints, but critics of the Obama era guidelines say they favored accusers and denied due process to those accused. So overall, I'm concerned. Um, Michelle Rolden wanted to be clear. She's biased, advocates for victim survivors, is part of a group educating students about sexual assault. Her fear about DeVos's proposal. You're not going to really be able to do Title IX if you're off campus and they can cross-examine you and all of this stuff. Why is anyone going to want to go through it? Under the proposed changes, the accused student or staff member would be able to cross-examine the accuser, though it would have to be indirect through a representative with no personal confrontation. Alleged misconduct that happened off campus and not at a school supervised location would no longer fall under Title IX. Schools could require a higher standard of proof, clear and convincing evidence to find the accused student responsible and impose sanctions like expulsion. DeVos also narrowed the definition of sexual harassment, which would now have to be so severe, pervasive, and objectively offensive that it effectively denies a person's equal access to the education program or activity. Personally, I think it's already hard as it, as it is for victims to come forward, and I just think they're just trying to make it more difficult for victims to um, come forward. But critics of the old system say DeVos is just evening the playing field. They point to lawsuits filed against schools by students who'd been suspended or expelled based on little evidence and a standard of proof they say was just too low. DeVos released the proposal today, but it has not been posted yet to the Federal Register website. When that happens, you'll have 60 days to file a comment before the new rules take effect. Back to you.